Oh, yeah. What's up, Road Dog P1 production expert and or sweet supernatural freak. I am Roy Golden, Dorado myself, coming straight at you from the countryside, previously recorded now on YouTube Live. Go Google, like me. Hey. George. <clears throat> oh man, I'm weak in the dolphin right now. Hey, listen, I, I am in the studio. You want to take a look? Do you want to take a look with me? A look in the studio with me, baby. I think you do. Check this out. Oh, here I am. It's the studio time. What I'm doing right now is processing some tracks through my outboard analog gear. Let's see if I can flip this thing around. Boop, 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 boop. Oh, there it is. Check this out. I've got a warm audio. There it is. Warm audio WA-76 compressor limiting amplifier. I've got my sweet manly core. Thank you, manly. I've got warm audio tone beast action. TB12 tone beast. What I'm doing is I am pre-processing these tracks that I've got through the analog gear into the heart of my studio, which is the Audient ID22. <gasps> these amazing tracks and inject them with Maximum Mojo. Maximum Mojo injection for mixing and mastering. That's what I'm doing today. And I've been getting incredible results as I re-record, rearrange, remix, remaster my debut album, Omniville. I'm calling it Omniville Unleashed. Why Unleashed? Because it's gonna be off the chain, off the chain. <laughs> it is, it is. It's really gonna be great. I made some egregious errors first time through. Because I'm a newbie rube. Only been doing this mixing thing about a year. And I was in a horrible space, horrible space. But now I'm in a new space and it's sounding Barely adequate. <laughs> it's just barely adequate, but it's a lot better than what I had before. If you haven't seen that, check out my YouTube channel and go to Load Me Out Road Dog. It's the last time that I spent some time in my previous studio apartment. Check this out though. This is treated room here. I'll turn on some light and get some light up in this place. Okay, this is a functional bedroom studio. Look, it's a bed. So whenever I get ready to go sleepy times, shh, 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 shh. I take this and, and then you'll notice I've got acoustic treatment going all around the room on the back wall. And this is really the most amazing thing ever. Check this out. This is, everybody, Owens Corning semi-semi-rigid fiberglass. It's got made the most significant difference ever to anything. Ever to anything. <laughs> that's a real big difference, and that's exactly what it's made. That is exactly what else do we... Oh, yeah, check it out. This is... He's an Academy Award winner. And what this has done is reminded me each step. We've got Fleet Rick Pinto and Idris. Oh, it. For the stars. High levels of creativity and storytelling production mastery. John Ridley rocks, by the way. I'm a huge fan of John Ridley. Um, and I put it right there. And also it was, uh, you know, this stuff is kind of ugly. 
a bass track. The song is called Kiss Another Wave. It's one of my favorites. Very sexy. If you don't know James Ivey, go Google him. He is with the Pro Tools Expert, folks. James Ivey, Pro Hyphen Tools Hyphen. Two, ladies and gentlemen. I'm using, so I'm sending mono three from the DAW. Take a look at this. I've got a send manly, send WA, and then I've got return. Manly, return, warm audio. To the manly core. All right, channel three is going to the manly core. Channel four is going to the warm audio tone beast which then goes to the Warm Audio 76, which then goes back to the audience. Get it? Okay. So what I'm, gonna, what I'm gonna do now, check this out. What I'm going to do now, all right, out three, out four, little buses here. Mono bus, one out levels going into the equipment. The last thing is, in order to monitor the signal, in an answer, but Q, C U E, alpha, Q alpha, that I can hear through my mastering speakers. I'm using my mastering speakers professor as an energy shaper. What? What? An energy shaping device mechanism. The only way that I can get feedback. Tecton Designs. It's called the Lore S model. L O R E hyphen S. Lore S. Got it? Custom in British Racing Green. They say genius. That British style, baby. That's some unities. There's my Unity Audio. Oh, and don't forget ISO Acoustics. All right. Plus, I've got the speakers on. I don't know if you can see this. Uh, this thing, where is it? I don't think you can see it. It's a decoupling device that's normally used for sub though. But look at those, those are so sweet when it gets to mixing. All right, still with me? Great, thanks for hanging in there. Now let's get to the good stuff, okay? What I want here is somewhere, I wanna hit somewhere between Appropriately. Okay. Now let's check. I've got I've got levels coming back. First of all, ratio I want to set to 12. And I want to say QA. This could be loud. Alright, there's from the doll. And now all I'm hearing is the manly. I want to kiss this with a compressor someplace between 0.5 and 2. It's looking pretty good right there. Here's my compression settings. Play with the attack a little bit. That sounds better. All right, I'm liking where it is right there. Let's get some EQ going. I'm going to add some low end. I'm gonna neutralize the high. Right there is where I want it. So wherever that ended up being. So now I'm done with the manly. Okay, I'm done with the manly. Now I'm going to listen to the warm audio and I want to actually blend those sounds in. All right, let's see what we got going here. I'm gonna loop this, yeah, it's looping, it's fine. Yeah, reset it. All right. Just gonna level it off pretty good. Still wanna keep just a little bit of that. Thump. Let's see, where can I get it? Again, I'm going based on feel, how, how the air is moving through these mastering speakers to be my guide. 
right? How the air is being moved. That's how I determine my compressor settings. All right, release wise, I want Okay, still don't know about this attack. Right there. That's also kind of my guide. It's like whenever I go, oh, George, oh, wow. Oh, here we go, here we go. All right, I return. All right, so I've got the bass here. I've got bass return manly. And I'm going to say, go back to the beginning so that everything lines up. Track it. And I want to make sure that my waveforms are looking how I want before I go through the whole song. It should be nice and level. Just a little bit of that initial attack is coming through, but for the most part, yeah. Compared to the original one. See if you can see that. Look at this. At this point in time, I also like to stand and move around. Tim McGraw, first annual, everybody, first annual Tim McGraw fan, big fan of Tim McGraw. And look at this. Oh my gosh. Garth Brooks, ladies and gentlemen, check it out. Looking good. This is dated when? 1900 and when? <laughs> yeah. Not so much. I've got some acoustic treatment there in the corner behind the television set. I've got Ash and Pikachu, of course. I'm a little Pally and the Piggy Mommy. I've got some spare change in here. Dorado, all my best. <laughs> okay, <laughs> move along now, please, sir. Freak, you're such a freak. I know, Joe, but that's why you love. Oh. I've got a Matt Arkham, real dog. Matt Arkham. Yeah. Okay, that's driving my mastering speakers. And that's it. We are out of here. There is some hardware delay. Okay. Determined by sending a click track through, through a click track through Studio One and then using auto align to align the signal and the difference was 111 samples. Now check this out. This is what I want to show you because now I'm going to go back to my main mix. Okay. Now I've got control here. So parallel compression and tone shaping really. Let's listen for it. pretty good to me right now. Maybe a little too much actually. So I'll dial it back down. Should be able to tell right here. Okay. Track number one is done. From this point in time, whenever I do that for all the rest of my tracks, I'm doing that for port stems and do all these buses all the process which means the manly and the warm maximum mojo maximum mojo injection achieved i am roy golden dorado myself hopefully you've been entertained inspired and encouraged to make the music you want to hear 
be the change you need to see and live the life you dared to dream. Why make me leave when you can make be live? Like me.